Hey everybody, how's it going? This is Rob, back at it again with another video. And today we're going to be unpacking the Gorilla Song Machine Season 1 Mixtape Pack. Uh, there was a bunch of different versions that came out specifically for this album. You could have gotten it digitally, you could have collected the uh, different singles that had the uh, different songs on there uh, with the instrumentals and everything. But uh, I went ahead and just got the one with the mixtapes, and I believe this one came with a t-shirt. There were a bunch of other different versions, like uh, with vinyls and stuff like that, but I felt like that was too bulky. Um, but we're going to go ahead and just get this one. Uh, they come with, I believe, four collectible mixtapes, and I think I got a t-shirt and the CD itself with an exclusive ticket to a exclusive live show uh, called the Circle of Friends. So uh, we're going to go check that out. But let's go ahead and take a look at what we got inside the package uh let's go ahead and open the cd and i know these are the mixtapes so let's go ahead and open that second and then we're going to go with the cd that is always really satisfying to open up a, a mailer like that with just the zip but anyway let's go ahead and take this out And then here is the cover art for a song machine. I gotta say, I really love the array of random stuff that's on the keyboard. Uh, it really just looks like something out of an ice spy book, but only something that Jamie Hilda could come up with. But uh, I really love the fact that uh, Gorillaz is coming out with more stuff every year. Um, they already had the Now Now, and then they had the album Humans. And I remember back in the day, they would only come out with an album like pretty much every five years, and they would make like a B-sides album and then just disappear and do other stuff. But I'm uh, glad to see they're still doing stuff and making new music with a bunch of different people and getting different cultures in there. So it's pretty good, I gotta say. All right, now we're gonna check out the cassettes and they're all stylized by every band member, obviously. So we're gonna have 2D, Noodle, Murdoch, and Russell's cassettes. And they're all gonna have uh, stuff that say something different on them with little different icons. So we're gonna go ahead and check out Noodle's first. All right, and then here is the cassette. Uh, hers is the only one that's obviously written in Japanese because, you know, she's Noodle. And uh, I'm going to put the translation up here. It is Noodle's Super Awesome Song Machine Mix, and it's also available on YouTube if you want to take a listen to uh, the playlist that she made. But I love all the, uh, the little stickers that are on there. Look at all those cute little cats. They're really cool. But then, strangely enough, uh, hers cassette was the hardest to put back in. So <laughs> let me see if I can put this back in here. Just gonna, like tease it a little bit and push there we go and that was noodles cassette now we're going to go ahead and take a look at 2d's cassette all right now we're going to go ahead and take a look at 2d's cassette it's the red one and let's see here it says Song Machine made by 2D from Gorillaz. All right, and now we're gonna flip it over. I hope you like it. I do love this album, but uh, personally for me, I feel like uh, this one was a little underwhelming. I wish there was a little bit more characteristic on this tape, uh, except for just the smiley face and just the I hope you like it. Um, I know Noodles was probably the more, the more fleshed out cassette just because it has the stickers and it's in Japanese. So we're gonna go ahead and check out Russell Hobbs and see if he has anything different on his. And we're gonna pull it out here and it is orange and it's gonna say presents a flaming hot song machine mix with the I guess an ice cream ghost is what it looks like and then the same uh, little skull figure that says strange times uh, again pretty underwhelming but uh I like that ghost that's a <laughs> that weird ghost has a tip on it I don't know what the hell that's about but uh, that's Russell Hobbs tape and now we're gonna go to the main man himself the Beelzebub soul sullen man himself murdoch nichols the pickle the eye to boff uh we're gonna go check a look at his tape uh man i really love how uh how fleshed out his character is but i think that's why murdoch's my favorite just because he's he's pretty much like the uh the uh, comedy relief of the band and uh, we're gonna have the uh 
choose Pazuzu, that uh, demon from the Exorcist. And yeah, there's some there's some stuff here for Murdoch. Murdoch Strange Times, and it has uh, the times, the numbers of like when he went to jail and all that stuff. So yeah, that's pretty cool. Glad that they made it green, because if it wasn't any other color, I I don't know what color it would be. Murdoch, but his is definitely green. Alrighty, now we're gonna go ahead and check out the t-shirt. I'm actually really excited about the t-shirt just because anytime Gorillaz comes up with a new shirt, I always have to have it. Um, their designs can be hit or miss depending on uh, what shirt you get. I mean, I know there's some that feature all the characters and then there's some that only feature one. And some of their designs can be underwhelming, specifically if it's like the human's design and it's just, you know, the album cover on a t-shirt and that's kind of boring. But uh, with this one, it's, uh, well, it's well thought out. It has a lot of different characters on it. The colors are really cool. And let's go ahead and pull it out and see the well-built detail that's in this shirt. Alrighty, now let's go ahead and check out this shirt here. And check out, whoa, look at all that color, man. Uh, I love how Jamie really designs his characters and how very well detailed they are, specifically in the clothing and in just the anatomy. So let's go ahead and take a look at that beautiful detail in the coloring and in the line work. Alrighty guys, that's going to be the end of this video. Thank you guys so much for watching and I can't wait to see season 2 and what Gorillaz has in store next. I'll catch you guys in the next video whenever I make a new one. You stay safe and take care of each other. See you later.